what's up kings and queens so i for one want to apologize i am not in the most like uppity mood i want to be that you know like the first thing that you guys click on my channel and you hear and you listen to is like what up kings what up queens but honestly if i do that right now i really do feel fake and i don't want to fake it for you guys um I have kind of been really stuck with this whole YouTube channel thing. Like, I feel like I'm having, like, a blockage, if that makes any sense to anybody. Um, and it's, I think it's because of my friend passing away. No, I know it's because of that. Um, I really haven't been feeling, like, motivated. Um, I've obviously had to still continue to work. You know, do my regular life, so it's like the end of the day is like what do I want to really film well I don't know that's why I always tell myself I don't know I'll get to it tomorrow maybe something will pop in my head tomorrow and another thing that kind of like really sucks too is that her passing kind of um has made my husband and I kind of separate a little bit um might be that he needs more time maybe I need more time just to be alone and just to be with our own thoughts so that also has been difficult um so I don't know what I'm going to film today it's a Sunday I've been by myself all day with my thoughts um I've been thinking a lot about getting a tattoo uh on my in my other video I showed you guys that I love the moon and I found a really dope picture today that I think I'm gonna get but I'm not really 100% sure if I do then that means I'll be posting this video if I don't then you won't see this video until I don't know I guess I feel better um I'm taking it hard one obviously because she's my friend and two it's because I've never experienced death like me myself I have never experienced it I don't know anybody within my immediate family that has passed away so therefore I don't know how to handle it if that makes any sense I don't know how I'm supposed to feel I don't know how the my spouse is supposed to feel how long it takes to heal like there's so many questions right like I don't know does he need space do I need space I just know that we're not in a good place I'm not in a good place and like I keep saying and I will say it from the very beginning our channel is real I wanted to keep it real I want to get on here and just say why I haven't been posting I didn't post at all last week so it's been a week and I really wanted to be consistent with it because I don't know I just kind of I, I mean from what I've been doing the research on it if the more that you upload videos and the more you know YouTube sees that you're more committed to it so therefore more people watch it not that I care for it like if I ever do make a make any kind of money for it honestly it would probably like go back to like my community helping the homeless or whatever it might be like I really thankfully I don't live a lavish life like I'm not rich but I also don't need for anything and that by my alone I'm happy with my husband and I are happy with the life that we currently have however you know i want to get the word out i want to like when i say the word out i mean like awareness to certain situations that we are talking about if that makes any sense like this last one is like suicide okay that we didn't think we were gonna have to make a video about that so soon it happened so it's just taking us a little bit longer just to post more videos and be more in tune I guess with everything that's going on um I really miss my husband doing like I guess we haven't done very many chat like like not channels but videos together but the one that we did I really liked it um he gave me like a lot of confidence to start it off I didn't know what to say or what to like blurt out I guess so he took over and I really appreciate that so hopefully we can get back to that very soon um but just bear with us it is just you know 
what's the grieving grieving process then? Um, still taking a little bit of time, but that's okay. You know, everything takes time, and we will be all right. My saying has always been peace and love. My Instagram is peace and love. I've been saying that for so many years, so many years. It's freaking crazy. And y'all never guess what my like fla favorite flower is. Like, I actually have it on my shirt right now. I'm on my sweatshirt. And that to me brings, like whenever I see it, I think of peace and like happiness and like joy and like tranquility and like inner, I don't know, just inner peace overall. So if you do see, I'm gonna cut it short. So I'm already at like six minutes. I can talk forever, y'all know that. Um, but if you do see the end of it, you know that I got the, the tattoo. I'll probably show like a small little clip it clip of me getting it and then the after part. But my favorite flower is a sunflower. I love sunflowers. I love like how they make you feel so happy when you see them and they're like so so vibrant. I don't know if you can kind of see it. Like look how vibrant and just like happy. Like you can't not smile when you see this. It's like yeah, it's a beautiful flower. All right, stay tuned guys. All right, and one more thing since I'm already on here because I'm not going to make a whole separate like video for this particular thing that I, I'm working on. It's like a little small project. I came across the information um, like two or three days ago. If you want to help the homeless around your community, your state, whatever it might be did you guys know that they are actually eligible for the $1,400 stimulus check I'm like what they can get them some money so what I'm planning to do I'm actually researching local tax offices that they can go to walking like walking distance so they can file for it and then they'll get it back like on a debit card which I think that is so dope. Like, for, I mean, $1,400 is a lot. And then, especially to somebody that's on the streets that might need, like, food or, you know, whatever it might be. They might want to splurge and go and, like, get a hotel room. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how that works. I think, like, you need an ID. Shoot, I don't know. But I am trying. I, I love to help. So, I am going to, like, f figure it out what I need to do what tax office I need to go to I will print out all the information that they need including like their phone number like the name of the tax office that they need to go to and then I'm going with my terrible uh, drawing skills I'm going to like draw from where they're located because it's like a certain like location in my uh, in Fort Worth Texas it's like underneath a bridge on Lancaster where that's where they're like sleep at night so I'm going to like write up like not write draw a map of like from where you're at you need to walk this and then turn on that street and that, and that street to try to make it as like easy as I possibly can for them because I know a lot of them probably don't have phones or whatever it might be I want to make sure that I do my part that they know and if they know already more power to you if you don't know we need to get you your four fourteen hundred dollars because if there's people out here getting it you should too why not free money all right i'm not getting it it's all good i'd rather somebody else get it get my portion double it up whatever it might be but if you can do that for your community i strongly 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 urge you to do it to reach out it literally doesn't take very like long to do it google tax office close to that particular area get their information make sure you call them first to make sure that they're you know doing it and then go to your local like ups or wherever you can get a bunch of just copies because i don't have a computer not a computer but a printer um just get them to do it for you print out as much flyers as you can and go hit them streets and let them know like hey bro did you know that you are eligible for the $1,400 stimulus check no well let me tell you about it and then give them the information and go on with that or whatever so 
that's my little snippet little clip on that that's currently what I'm working on I love to do things to uplift me and like make me feel like I'm doing something like God sent me to this earth for a purpose and my purpose is to help other people and it's always been like that so I'm going through a hard time what better way to like balance it out help other people so hopefully you guys do the same thing